Hey, it's Andy Drifter here. Hope your day is going well. Got myself a blaster of 2024 Topps Baseball Series 2. Let's begin. Jose Alvarado Phillies maintain the best record in the National League. Superstar greetings. Mike Trout, Bobby Witt Jr., who is still leading the AL in batting average. Kyle Hendricks, Jake Myers, Jose Caballero, Jordan Wicks rookie card, MJ Melendez, Sonny Gray. We've got a blue border of Eric Fetty and uh, Evan Carter, stars of MLB rookie card, who is still on the IL. Rangers so far have been somewhat disappointing in the way they've played, being that they are uh, reigning champs. Here we go, a Taiwan Walker. That's uh, a fireworks parallel. You Darvish, Garrett Stubbs, Marcus Stroman, Giancarlo Stanton. Man, he was having such a good year. He seemed healthy, 18 home runs, and as he was routing third base, hamstring injury, the same one that caused him to miss some games last year on the 10-day IL in the meantime. The Yankees have acquired J.D. Davis, and uh, we shall wait and see what uh, Big G and the status of his injury is. You know, he was on his way to possibly another 40 home run season. Actually, he's only had one 40 home run season in his career. That's when he hit, uh, what was it, 59 in 2017, active home run leader. Teoscar Hernandez having a very nice year. He's in on a one-year deal with the Dodgers on his way to maybe a 30 home run season. Tuki Toussaint, Lawrence Butler, Stuart Fairchild, MV3, Bryce Harper, who just passed Gary Carter and Lance Parrish on the all-time home run list. And uh, he's creeping into that MVP conversation. He, along with his teammate uh, Alec Bohm, he's already got two MVP trophies. Matt Olson last year got some MVP votes and uh, had 54 home runs last year. He'll be lucky to get half that this year. Edmundo Sosa. Josh Hader has underperformed along with a lot of his Astros teammates this year. Alex Cobb, Paul DeJong, Ken Waldachuk, Nick Ladolo. Good pitcher for the Reds, although they are in last place. Trey Turner back in the Phillies lineup. Reese Hoskins, formerly of my Phillies, got 11 home runs. Uh, possibly could have a 30 home run season if he gets hot. That's what he had. He had 30 home runs on the nose in 2022. Did not play at all last year. Uh, Bo Bichette, stars of MLB. That is a chrome refractor. And Manny Machado. Bryce Miller. Another... Fourth of July parallel, very nice. Uh, Reese McGuire, Spencer Steer, Aston Kirschdad rookie card, very nice. Tristan Cassis, how about those Red Sox playing some great baseball? Brian Rocio, Brett Beatty, Eloy Jimenez, Harrison Bader, Gold Glove winner, Ian Happ, Joey Wendell, El Bob, one of the most coveted players as we get closer and closer to the trade deadline he is a gold glove winner an all-star last year had 38 home runs and pretty much the only player on that white Sox team who's actually doing anything and uh, that is kyle harrison would it be something if my phillies got a hold of el bob add him to that already monster of a lineup logan porter Rookie card, very nice. Brandon Williamson, Zach McKinstry. Pirates team card. Marcel Ozuna. He's in the top five when it comes to RBI, batting average, and home runs. Very much in that triple crown race. Braves still have that first wild card spot. Chris Bassett. Kenta Maeda. Michael King. Brennan Hanafi. Logan Porter. 
Matt Beerling started off his career with my Phillies. What do we got here? We have uh, Ronald Acuna. An insert of some kind. Unfortunately, he is out for the season. Last year's unanimous MVP winner. And another MVP winner, uh, Christian Yellick, who took home the trophy in 2018. Ezekiel Duran, Nick Allen, got here, uh, you want to say Atlee Rutschman and Gunner? Yeah, Gunner Henderson has a shot to become the third player in Orioles history to get to 50 home runs in a season. The only members of that club are Brady Anderson and uh, Chris Davis. Henderson, 24 home runs, and Rutschman among the league leaders in batting average. Dynamic duo, JT Real Mudo and, uh, what is that, Alec Bohm? No, Aaron Nola. Should know my Phillies better, but I, I didn't in that case. Chris Sale, all-star pitcher for the White Sox and Red Sox, having a career year kind of written off. And uh, he is anchoring that Braves pitching rotation. Jose Miranda, Jose Altuve. Casey Schmidt, Jonathan Bolin, Shane McClanahan, that is a rainbow refractor, Sedan Raffaella, back to Nick Allen. All right, final pack, maybe some final pack magic. And, oh, we've got ourselves the hot dog refractor, Luis Garcia. Very nice. Matthew Batten, Weston Wilson, Orion Kirkering. Had the chance to meet him not too long ago. There is footage of that autograph signing. Going over to my short section to check it out. Uh, Enrique Hernandez, Brewers, still in first place. Michael Conforto. Yendris Gomez, rookie card, Jose Abreu, 2020 MVP winner, and uh, one of the quickest and furthest falls from grace. This guy was an all-star, and uh, I don't know what happened. In 2022, he put up very nice numbers for the White Sox. He went to the Astros, got a contract. I want to say it's, what, four years, 19 mil per season, somewhere in that neighborhood. Last year, the stats were down, but... Halfway respectable. He drove over 90 runs. This year, did next to nothing. Astros said enough is enough. Happy trails. And uh, I don't know. I don't know if we'll see him again. It's a shame. Dylan Moore. Hunter Goodman. Otani. Throwback card. Who is leading the majors in batting average. He's leading the National League in home runs. He's among the league leaders in RBI, OPS. And uh, once again, doing an MVP campaign. And we finish off with another former MVP in Joey Votto, who last I checked was signed to the Blue Jays, but I don't know. I don't know uh, if they have any intention of putting him in the lineup, calling him up. He's not playing in the minors. So that is it for this Series 2 rip. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to hit like and subscribe and uh, enjoy the rest of your Tuesday.